Happy Friday, everybody. This is a pick a card reading for today, Friday, August 20th. You pick a card, it's your main energy, but I do pull them all together. And August 20th, babies, we will do your reading next. If you pick card number one, you have the Eight of Pentacles. Okay, so for some of you, something is still a work in progress, and I think it's got to do with um, maybe these um, um, renovations that you're doing or um, construction, um, remodeling or something with the home is what I'm feeling for some of you. You've got lessons that you learned here, so things are still a work in progress, all right? Uh, maybe you are the one who is doing this and this is your job and it's like waiting for, you know, your money will be coming in. I see um, you money, um, money will be coming in for this. Um, I do feel that there is this sense of apprenticeship today where you're learning something. OK, so it, it does take time, but you will, um, you know, your perseverance will pay off. For some of you, this can also be do, uh, dealing with a relationship. Um, this is like, um, trying to take it to another level. Okay. So, um, it's still a work in progress. So the weight may still have to, you may still have to be patient. Now I do feel that there is some lessons that come with money and love today for you. Okay. If you pick card number two, you have the five of swords. All right. This is a day where, um, you could be very swift, quick, and be careful of not throwing the baby out with the bathwater. There is a sense of you're on the guard, you're defensive today. Um, this could be um, thoughts racing through your head, and it's like you're challenging yourself, or you got too much to do, and you're overthinking things. Um, change of perspective may help, too. I do see that this is a time where you are maybe shutting down someone that has hurt you, Maybe someone wants to reach out and talk to you is what I'm feeling. Um, you've learned your lessons here. This is like um, with people, they have made you angry. Um, they You may be he holding some kind of resentment against a person. But you have balanced yourself. You put your borders up and you um, are grounded. So there is a good side to this. And you're not ready to um, go through that cycle again so I do feel that energy but if you're just trying to get a lot of things done and you're kind of like um putting this all in your head like oh I gotta do this I gotta do this I gotta do this um it's time to center and um know that you will get things done okay you got the touch you got the the ideas it's just um slow down you're a little bit anxious today it's what I'm picking up today as well okay so hmm. a little bit of conflict here and it could be just Mental conflict, you know. If you pick card number three, you have the hangman. This is a major arcana, important day for you. Um, this could be, I feel, you're wanting to, or you're waiting for something. But guess what? I do feel whatever it is, you're going to get what you want. And it's going to come when you least expect it. I see victory, success. Yeah. So it's coming. It's coming. That is the best I can explain there, honestly. <laughs> Um, eight of pentacles, five of swords, and the hangman. Hangman is a major arcana for us today. There is an energy of rebirthing today, major decisions, and getting things under control. But how we do do it is going to be, okay, take that break too. So there is a sense of too swift, you know, we have to do it in a balanced manner. Um, don't assume anything or make assumptions without knowing the facts and figures. We have an exceptional strength to us today. We can get through any mental challenges, any work or any overthinking or feeling like, oh, blah, I'm just stuck. Okay. We can get through a lot. We are heading in the right path here. Okay. So I do feel that energy. Um, I do feel the energy of a cancer Capricorn. All right. Um, there are blessings, blessings coming in. I feel that there are blessings in disguise, no matter what's going on too. But we have to make this decision. Um, maybe we thought that we've been procrastinating on something. We kind of push it too far. So we have to kind of balance that energy. It is a time of standing up for ourselves, taking back our power too. Okay. And I do pick up also a Taurus energy. All right. 
Well, that is the reading for today, August 20th, Friday. I hope you have a wonderful Friday. Happy birthday if you're born today, August 20th. This is a very quick and general reading, your solar, your theme, and your wish card. Solar, your theme is the strength card. Wow, did I just talk about strength today? So you have a major arcana. Why I feel, because this is a year where you're going to have a lot of breakthroughs, new beginnings, um, uh, passive aggressive type of energy, sudden changes, and you're rebuilding some things. You could be moving. These are quick things that come in, changes of plans, shocks, surprises, good and bad. Uh, so I do feel that energy. I also feel that this is a year of anything that has been holding you back. Any addictions you have, any obsessions, anything that you feel chained to, any manipulative people or bad people that you hang around with, whatever it is, any situation, it is time to break that cycle. You can get through it, change your life. If not, the universe is going to come and do it for you and you're not going to like it too much. So you do have that energy. For a lot of you, is getting through some of your fears. This could be also a... Let's say a phobia, you finally um, clear up, okay? So it's like getting through a lot. Your desires, your um, wants, your needs are very powerful this year, but you need to uh, do it in a slow manner. Don't push anything, rush anything. Otherwise, you could stumble and fall, okay? Um, when it comes to work, career, and school, I see... Um, Pay attention to someone younger than you. They could be leading you to important information or a new job or a new idea. Okay, so I do like that. But you're, you're, you're in baby steps here. For some of you, if you've been waiting to get promoted or whatever it is, um, you're, you know, you're at the beginning stages. So it takes time and you have the strength. When it comes to finances... Taking care of you overall, meaning um, investing in yourself, in your health, and also there is an emotional connection to money this year. When it comes to love, if you are single, you may not be happy with the choices that, uh, that's, been hap that's been coming at you. Be careful of people wanting to take advantage of you or, um, you know, ask you for some kind of money or something like that as well, because there's going to be some changes there. Um, I do feel that work may be occupying a lot of your time or career and be careful of meeting someone at work. OK, because there could be a possibility there's a clause that you can't date someone at work or you may lose your job because of it. It's not the best energy. That's for someone out there. When it comes to well, the ones that are in a relationship, I do feel there's going to be a significant celebration this year. Maybe you celebrate an anniversary or there is um, very happy energy. I do like that. So there is some um, in a, a very good energy here. Maybe um, new friends coming in with couples that you uh, make friendships with. So I do see that kind of energy. You're going to be celebrating something about your relationship. Uh, for all relationships, uh, the past is returning. People from the past may be coming back. Um, this is a year of also kind of rehashing. Um, it's almost like karma. There's like karmic tinge to relationships, all of them. For some of you, maybe um, get, you know, like school reunions. Maybe you get together with people from your childhood. Children are involved too, so I do feel that energy karmic love or relationships maybe it's the friend that got away the w love that got away kind of so we're seeing that energy okay all right your wish for your solar year is this queen of swords all right for some of you you can manage this you have to be persistent um persistent and serious about it and you it will come to you it's it's there it's within reach for you it's a yes for others i do feel a significant female will be helpful. Looks like an air, um, air sign energy will be able to man to to help you bring this to fruition. Okay, the um important numbers for your solar year one six three five um twenty five seven 
eight twenty one. I hope you have a wonderful birthday and a blessed solar year ahead. Everyone else, a wonderful Friday, and bye for now.